Ugh. You have gotta be kidding me right now. I can't believe that I got suspended from Beyond Affix High School and got grounded until my suspension is over. This is totally dumb as heck. What should I do to get my idea next? Hold on for a minute. Is that how you want me to do my next experiment? Well then, you guessed it. I'm going to do the Beyond Pedestrian Fight and Rudeness at Beyond Street. This is going to be a funny idea. Ha 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 ha. Oh look! Beyond Pedestrians! It's time for me to do the Beyond Pedestrian Fight and Rudeness by saying rude things to Beyond Pedestrians because it will be funny. Hello there, bro. Hi. How are you doing today? You slumpy punks. Hey, don't call us punks. That was very rude to us. Both of you are such dumb cowards. Stop it right now or I will kick your butt. Look behind you, simps. Huh? Where? What behind? Hey, what did you do to the fat person? I pushed him because I told him to look behind me. Dude, you are such a rude person for pushing a fat person. I don't care, stinky. A big fat person deserves to get hurt, you fat sucker. Stop that right now, or we will call the cops on you. Whatever you say, stupid dumbos. I'm out of here. For God's sake. That stupid strange girl for pushing me while I was looking behind her and saying rude things to us, isn't she? Yeah, she is. Wow. Another Beyond Pedestrians. Now it's time for me to say rude things to them for the second time. Ha ha ha. Bro you suck so hard. And Jack Paul, you are a cringy scumbag. Hey. How rude of you saying that to me. And just because of that. I'm not a scumbag. I'm a famous character, you know that. I agree with you, Jack Paul. You better not call me a scumbag or say rude things to me or else. Me too. And do not even think about saying rude things to us by calling us scumbags or else we will report the police on you. Me three. If we ever saw you saying rude things to other people, then we will call the cops on you. Me four. Do not even think about making us fight with you for saying bad things to us. And me five. Don't you dare to make us call the cops on you or fight with you by saying bad and rude things to us. Got that? Oh really? Do you want to fight with me? Well, okay. Take that, losers. So long, scumbags. I'm going somewhere else to say another rude things to other people. God. That's the dumbest strange girl we've ever seen for saying rude things to us and trying to fight with us by hurting us. How can we possibly stop those strangers from saying mean stuff to us? Let us hope to forget about the meanest strangers saying bad stuff to us because we can't recognize the strange girl's name yet. I know right, Jack Paul. We are pretty sure that the unknown strange girl could get arrested by the cops for saying rude stuff to us, but we cannot call the cops on her because she's running away from us. Ugly idiot. Stop with the rudeness right now, or we will report you to the police station. We are fine people. Hey, why the hell did you punch me in the face like that? That was very hurtful and offensive to do that. Oh. Do you want to try to fight with me? Yeah. It better not be, you piece of crap. Oh, do you really want dare to fight with you, huh? Well, okay then, it's on then, you weak loser. Well, bring it on you chump. Come on you stupid butthole. You're going to lose the fight and I'm going to win the fight.
No more fighting, please. I'm breaking serious. I will call the cops on you if you don't stop fighting. Like seriously, stop hurting the man. Frick you ugly selfish woman. You're not getting away with me. I will win the fight and stop fighting with you if the woman call the cops on you. K.O. Shake that, you foolish loser. That's quite enough. I'm calling the cop- Not so fast. You are not going to call the cops on me because I punched you in the face. Ha 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 ha. Goodbye you stupid heads. Alright, that's it. We are calling the cops on the strange girl because I lost the fight and she's rudely saying mean things to us. Hey mom and dad, can we take me to the mall, please? I'm sure I can get a lot of toys from the mall. Sorry little kid, but we are afraid that we can't go to the mall to buy the toys for you because the mall has a lot of COVID-19. Oh, that's okay, mom. At least we can go to the restaurant instead of the mall because I can eat normal food. That's my girl. I'm very glad you heard that. Um, mom? What's that an unknown strange girl doing here? And also, why she looks scheming? I don't know about her. But please forget about this stranger because you are shy. Hello little girl, you are an ugly crybaby because you are a mother f***ing b <laughs> <laughs> What the hell, girl? Why would you do that to my little girl? That is very unacceptable and vulgarly mean to her. Now look what you have done. You just made my little girl cry for saying nasty stuff to her. How about you go f*** yourself and shut the f*** up, you son of a b***h holes. You do not ever swear at us with swear words. That is forbiddingly prohibited, you know that. We will call the cops on you if you don't stop swearing at us. Stupid civilian f***ing turd head. That is so it, strange lady. We are calling the police to arrest you. B***h, f***h, mother f***h. You, or jerks. What is wrong with you, mean it? Man, you pathetic fool, and you suck. I'm gonna break your face because you say any offensive stuff to other people and make the woman run away. You dumb. That's what you get for calling us dumb. Now stay away from us right now, or else we will call the cops on you. Oh, do you really think you're clever for hitting me in the face? Well then, I'm gonna beat the sh** out of you, you piece of sh**. Wait, what? Please, no. Don't do it. I'm sorry. This is my mistake. Please don't beat me up. No 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 no. Ow, 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 ow. It hurts so much. Please. Somebody. Help me. Call an ambulance and the police. Ow, 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 ow. Oh my god. Grace, are you okay? Emma, do you think I'm okay? No. The strange girl just beat me up while I made a mistake. Can anyone please call an ambulance to take me to the hospital and the police to arrest her? It hurts so much and the strange girl needs to get arrested for beating me up. Shut the f*** up, lady. You deserve it to get beaten up by me. I hope you will be dead soon. Strange lady, stop telling her to STF you. It's very rude to her. Also, for telling her to STF you while she was injured, we are calling to police to arrest you. Man, why don't you shut the hell up or I will push you off. That's it. We're calling the police to arrest- Nice try, dude. You can't call the police to arrest me. The cops are on the way. I hope you will be arrested soon because you say the rudest stuff to us and beat Grace up. Oh shit. The cops are coming to arrest me. I have to run and evade away as fast as possible. You're under arrest for beating the lady up and saying rude stuff to the pedestrians. You are coming with me to the police car right now. Nope. You can't arrest me. I'm going to run away and continue doing the rudeness of the pedestrians. Goodbye retarded officers. Hey, 
I told you to come with me to the police car. Not just run away. You know what? I'm getting more cops and police cars to have a chance to arrest the strange girl. I'm gonna keep your face for being racist. Moron. Suck my c***er. You stupid idiot. Screw you. I'm going to get you. Forget it, Amy. The cops are going to arrest the stupid strange girl. Hey, watch it. Be careful, you piece of crap. Hey! What's the problem with you, you dumb me. I'm gonna hit your face. Goodbye, mother Oh, you're going to get busted if you say mean stuff to me. How would both of you like to have with me, you stupid You are an annoying donkey and piece of freaking crap. your face up. See you later, selfish Let's get inside the car to drive and evade away before the cops and the police car are going to arrest me. Don't let the strange lady escape away from the cops. You can't catch and arrest me. Ha ha ha. Pull this car over to the side of the road. I repeat, pull over immediately. Stop the car right now. The police roadblock. Oh great. I'm so busted right now. Ah. Uh, we called you. Get out of the car right now. You are now under arrest for saying we're stuck to pedestrians or other people and trying to escape from the cops and police cars. You have the right to remain silent. Now let's come with me to the police car to send you to the jail from the police station because I've handcuffed you and you will never escape, ever. You are f***ing pathetic. Strange lady, shut up and let's go to the police station right now. Yeah, 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 I get it, officer. I'm so busted right now. Strange lady, you are going to stay in the jail for 17 days because you say rude stuff to pedestrians and other people. I hope you learned your lesson. Anyways, what's your name? We can't recognize your name. I'm Mal. Okay. Now, if you excuse us, we have to go back to the police car because we have to find the guilty criminals. So, have fun in jail for 17 days. Gosh freaking dang it. I can't believe I've got sent to jail for 17 days for saying rude stuff to beyond pedestrians. Now I can't do any experiments anymore because I'm stuck in jail. Oh, and there's one more thing, Mo. The visitors are coming to your jail because we have a lot of explaining to you. And don't you even think about escaping from the jail and bailing yourself off by breaking the jail bars away, or else I will send you to another jail for the longest time. Okay. Fine. I won't break any jail bars. Good. Mel, would you care to explain why you got sent to jail for 17 days? Just tell me the truth right now or else you will be suffered the biggest consequences. Well, it's because I do beyond pedestrian rudeness and fight by saying rude stuff to pedestrians and making pedestrians fight with me. I thought my experiment is crudely funny and cruelly hilarious. So this is why I got arrested by the cops for an irrational reason. Can you let us bail me out? Hell no. We ain't gonna bail you out because it's the cops job and you did a lot of ridiculous troublemaking experiments unless you wait for the cops to bail you out after 17 days. Also, we cannot believe you did be in pedestrians rudeness and fight by saying rude stuff to pedestrians and making pedestrians fight with you. You know it's overly offensive and allegedly intolerant to do that. And no, your experiments are stupid, nonsensical, and unfunny. For this result, we're going to have the nerve to give you a timeout until the 17-day jail sentence is over.
Now stay in jail and go to the bed and don't you think about escaping the jail until we say so. And by the way, if you think about escaping from the jail by destroying the jail bars out, then the cops will be responsible for this. So, have fun in jail for 17 days, just like the cops said. Curses. I can't believe that Non, Lee, and Pri can't let me bail out. Now I'm stuck in jail for 17 days and I can't do any hilarious experiments anymore thanks to the stupid cops. And no, I am not planning to escape from the jail or breaking the jail bars out because I need to wait for 17 days to get out of this stupid jail and go back home. This is my worst day ever. Goodness. Why on earth did Mel have a lot of bad experiments and stop with this nonsense? I know right, Dad? But unfortunately, Miss is a troublemaker because he can plan more stupid experiments. If he does, then he will be in timeout or grounded. Oh wait. Andy is calling me on my phone. Let me answer if she hopefully can go back home. Hello Andy? Hey Nan, I have some good news to tell you. Really? What is it? I have finished taking care of Aloy's wand to Paris because she's now feeling better and her injuries are completely removed. That means I can go back home and deal with Mal and Miss. That's very good to hear that, Andy. And by the way, Mal was sent to jail for 17 days for doing pedestrian rudeness because her behavior is seriously horrible. I see, Nan. Mal should deserve it for being in jail. I hope she will never do any stupid experiments and she will be taught a lesson because she's in jail. Okay, if you excuse me, I must leave the call now because I have to go back home after taking Eloise wanted Perez back home. So, catch you later. Goodbye, Non. Goodbye, Andy. See you later. Hey, Eloise, I have some exciting news to tell you. Really? What is it? I have finished taking care of you, curing and recovering you, and removing your injuries completely. That means you are feeling better and you are no longer being brutally injured and severely painful anymore. Also, I can take you back home before I can go back home. Yay. That's good to hear that. Now I can finally walk with you to take me back home because my body injuries are completely removed. I'm very glad to hear that, Eloise. Now come with me to my car and take you back home before I can go back home. Hey Lion Pri, did you hear that about Andy's good news? I know you're very excited to say this. Really? Does that mean Andy is going back home? Yes. That's right, Lie. Andy can finally go back home because she finished taking care of Eloise at the hospital. I hope you will be excited to miss Andy so much. Oh boy. We can't wait to see Anta coming back home. We hope she will miss them so much. I'm very glad to hear the good news, Lion Pri. Now, if you excuse me, I must get going because Over needs to talk to me. So, I'll be right back. Goodness me. Miss Ann Mel should never say unwelcome back to Anta because it may be unacceptable stuff even though Mel is in jail, weren't they Pri? Yes, they were and it will be heartless to her.